channel. In this video, I'll be showing you how to uh, cross-play on on PS Minecraft uh, Bedrock Edition on PS4. And uh, this is not Minecraft PlayStation 4 Edition. This this is Minecraft uh, Bedrock Edition um, version 1.16.1. Um, so as you see, there's no Minecraft. This is a PS4. See my Minecraft. It, this is Bedrock Edition. It isn't the uh, old version. There's two different versions of Minecraft now: Minecraft Bedrock and Minecraft PlayStation Editions. It's like Xbox Editions, PlayStation Editions. They're the old versions now. Um, but as you, as you see, you load up onto Play. You've got your servers here. You've got your people on PlayStation Network you can join. Find cross-platform friends. You cannot join cross-platform cross games without a Microsoft account. Sign into a Microsoft account to join your friends' worlds. But I, as I guess you don't, you don't already have a Microsoft account. But here I'm going to go help you make a Microsoft account. If you don't already have an email address, I've made a video of how to make an email address. That uh, video will be in the description. It will work on mobile, iPad and PC. Um, what you want to do is press sign in with a Microsoft account. So here we are. This is the permanently associate with the current account on PlayStation Network. So you, what you want to do is connect to it. Uh, so let's go switch to my PC and we'll get to it. Hello, welcome back. Okay, so this can work on any device iPad, uh, iOS, Android. Any phone, you can do it on any phone, any smartphone. Uh, you can do it on PC like I am right now. So what you want to do is, to so get the code on there, what you want to do is search ak.ms ak slash remote connect. Here we are. So, so this will come up. Well, this won't come up because you have not made it in a Microsoft account. So what I'm going to do, do is go on here. Um, and then what you want to do is search up Microsoft because you need to make a Microsoft account. If you already ha if you already have if you if you already have if if you have if you have already made a Microsoft account, then uh, you can skip a little bit of this video until uh, we log in. Okay, so what you want to do is create a Microsoft account. Create an account. So this is in my old video of how how I made it. Um, pretty sure I still have it. No, that's not it. Um, just one minute. Okay, so here we are. I've got. I'm loading it. I'm. Put, I'm using my email, which I've made. Um, if, you, if you haven't already got an email address, or you don't know how to get one, video will be in the description of how to make an email address. Uh, so what you want to do is so type your email address that you've already put. Don't put this one because it isn't your email address. You'll make your own email address. Um, and then what you want to do is press next, and then it says you, what you want to do is make a password. So you, what you want to do is put your password, put a password you only know. Make sure no one else knows this. So what you want to do is your your date of birth and stuff. Date of birth. Here we are. Okay, so here we are. Create accounts. Need a little information. Verify email. So here we are. Like I said earlier, um, verify email. You have to verify your email sometimes. So let's go sign into our emails. So sign in. So remember email. Bob. Um, what is it? Bob. Um, eight one five one nine. Bob eight one five. Eight one five one nine at gmail dot com. This is not your email. This is my email, and then you want to put your email address. I mean your password in as well. So next, here we are. Protect your account. Just it's fine. You don't really need this. So here we are. We've logged into our thing. Oh look, we got we got a message from Microsoft. So this is our code. It's our code from Microsoft. To log in, and then what you want to do is copy and paste that and put that in there, and then you press next. Create an account. So here we have that's quite difficult, uh, like a capture kind of thing, which is like make sure you're not a robot. SX YV H 
HWVM. Okay, that's weird. GY, DXY, RH, YR6. Okay, hopefully I just did that right. Okay, yes, I did that right. Okay, so here we are. Look, we are logged into our Microsoft account. We, well, we've made a, made a Microsoft account. So now, you, what you want to do is go on the uh, a website again, the aka.mss, aka.mss, slash remote connect. So here we are, so with the code, I'm going to go put my code in, um, which is on my PS4 screen, to my next, okay? So here's your, your what, like, so enter the password to sign into the Microsoft account for PlayStation 4 with bobm 81519 at gmail.com. So what you want to do is put your email address in, I mean your password in, sign in. Okay, apparently that, that, that expired, so I need to go make a new one. So what you want to do is just sign in with it, just press the same thing again. Uh, signing into the Microsoft account. Okay, there we go, I've got, I've got a new code. So now that's what I need to put in. So uh, I need to put my code in. G two T Q N. All your code will be different from different people to your email address. Put the new one to because I think I took a bit too long. Okay, there we go. So it should have been signed in. You now sign into Minecraft for PlayStation before you can now safely close this window. Hey guys, um so okay we're back on PS4. So what you want to do, so what I need to do is uh, unfriend me again because it wasn't recording. Uh, signing into PlayStation Network, signing into uh, Microsoft account, so it should log you in. So you see at the left corner it will say Wizard Guitar 775. And then what you want to do is go to Play. We're going to go to Friends, Joinable Cross Platform Friends, Find Cross Platform Friends, put their username in. So mine's Wolfie Xbox 2064. 2064. Uh, what you need to do is um, download the Xbox app onto your PS4. I mean your mobile or whatever you're using. You need to need to um, make your you need to download the Xbox app and then log into your Microsoft account. Which, uh, if you don't, already, if you already have not made a, if you don't have already made an uh, email address, the which, uh, a link to a video how to make an email address will be in the description. Alright. So what you want to do is search up the name. This is LAN Games. This is because it's on my internet. It won't work. Well, it will work. It's just I don't want to do that. When I search up Wolfie Xbox two zero six four. And then I it should load up my game. Yep, that's it. Add friend. This is my PC account. Okay. Success. He was added to your friends list. Okay. So what they what they need to do is go into the Xbox app on their phone, including you. If they send you a friend request, you want to go to activity alerts. Wizard guitar. Send you a friend request. Add friend. And then, okay. So now they're your friends. Alright, so what you can do is join a ball cross platform friends, press X on that, and then it should connect to it. But my game might crash because I have mods on it. Unable to connect to the world. Okay, I, I think I might know why. It's because I'm not in the game right now. It's just reloading in. Um, but yeah, so this is fetching old worlds. This is all your old worlds, which you will have to change to the um, uh, bedrock version because you can see it's not Minecraft PlayStation 4 edition. It's now bedrock version. Okay, now I'm lo loaded into my game, my water park world. Let's see if I can connect. It might uh, my, my game might crash again. I'm not sure though. If it does crash, it'd be quite sad. Okay, so it's got mods. I think I've already downloaded these, but it's perfectly fine. So yeah, it's got it's, it, these are not normal mods. These are actual like modded mods, like you can get from the internet. And you can still get mods from Minecraft without Minecraft Java edition. It's easy. It just has to be an add-on, MC add-on. Can't be anything else. Otherwise, it does not work. 
So we see, as you can see, it's downloading the mods. For some reason, it's frozen. I guess my internet's kind of dead. My internet's dying. Okay, for some reason, it's stuck on 0 0.49 megabytes. I mean, it's supposed to be on 1.5 megabytes. It's just like one megabyte, and let me lie. One megabyte. And I yeah, my game froze. My game froze. I think my game might have crashed. <laughs> I think my game might have crashed. Don't know. I don't think that game works. But you can join anyone else. Uh, it's because I've got mods on this game, and so no one can else can join. I need to get rid of these mods on this server, but people, other people can join. Um, if I can press cancel, then I can't because my game's frozen. Um, but yeah, you can join anyone else's game. Um, so yes, this is how you cross platform. Um, I can't join my game though on my PC because um, it's got mods and it doesn't work on Xbox or PS4. So yeah. Okay, so guys, thank you everyone for watching. Um, and into your Microsoft account, how to cross platform. It's just a coincidence. It's just a not. It's just a coincidence that's not working for me right now because they've got mods in the game, which is not just which is you get off the internet, not from the store. Um, because it doesn't work on PC. I mean, it doesn't work on Xbox or PS4. It might work on Xbox. I think it does work on Xbox actually, but it doesn't but it doesn't work on PS4. Um, but anyway, you can join anyone else. PC people can join your game. PC people can join your PS4 world. Um, PC can join you, Nintendo Switch, mobile, iPad, literally anybody, any ver any version of Minecraft. Well, all all um, platforms of Minecraft can join the game. So that's just saying, uh, mobile people can join, iPad people can join, Nintendo Switch people can join, PC people can join. Uh, also, P P uh, PS4 people can join PC worlds. It's just you can't join my world because it's got mods on it. If you can understand, um, so yeah, that is basically how you make an email, uh, Microsoft account and how to cross platform on PS4. Everyone, thank you for watching. Uh, if you need any help, please comment down below what your issue is. Uh, everyone, th and uh, yes, thank you for watching. Goodbye.